welcome to a tiny series of mini tutorials on the Symmetry Drawing Apps iOrnament and iOrnament Pro. I'm Jürgen Richter Gebert. I'm the author of these apps. And well, people have been asking a lot about tutorials, about drawing advice. And uh, in this little series that you see here, and this is the first part of it, I want to go through all the functionality of the app. And on the other hand, I also want to share some kind of personal tricks of how to get the most out of that app. Uh, because, well, I'm a little bit experienced in some of the functionality, obviously, and uh, perhaps I can share a few of my own thoughts on the app. So today will be all about the color menu. And uh, well, you get the color menu when you press the palette button that you have here. And I think the basic usage is very self-explanatory. You just choose a color and then you can immediately draw with that color. And uh, well, there is at that level not much to be said about that. Uh, well, it becomes a little bit more interesting as soon as you use the first two sliders because they control the overall appearance of the color palette. The first controls the saturation and the second one controls the brightness of the colors. So for instance, if you want to draw a picture that is more pastel, uh, I recommend using a low saturation and full brightness here and just to stick with the palette that you get from these settings. Uh, let me erase my drawing here you get a very unsaturated red and uh, you can combine that with an unsaturated blue and say uh, yellow here. And I think you get the idea. These colors that you get this way uh, really harmonically fit together in a very nice way. You can also turn this idea upside down. And instead of drawing with many different colors, all in the same uh, saturation and brightness, you can say, I just stick to one color and I play with the values of brightness that I can get here. So let me see how that looks like. So now I've chosen a fully saturated red in full brightness and just let me draw the first stroke, say like that. And now gradually with each stroke, make this color a little bit darker and you see what you get is a kind of monochrome picture consisting just of one U and uh, many different variations of that and I hope the camera captures what I mean uh, because the color effect is really stunning. It's like uh, looking in a monochromatic room and see all the differences of uh, one specific color. Our next uh, tutorial will be about symmetry. You see, iOrnament is all about symmetry and uh, we will make a deep dive in the different possibilities of how to apply symmetry to your strokes. And I just say, oh, well, keep on doodling. And I just play a little bit with my graphics here by adding some kind of gold uh, to make it look a little bit more outstanding. And, uh, well, I hope you enjoy that picture as much as I do.